Hey, how's it going? And welcome back to the series where we get all the Creation Club mods starting from level one. And in this video, we'll be getting one of the best mage mods from Creation Club. Well, in my opinion, anyway. And that's arcane accessories. Now, remember, this series is just me getting them. So, for full specs, close-ups, and thoughts, check the links in the description box below for the full review video. And I do go into a lot of detail on this mod in that particular video. So definitely worth checking it out anyway let's go get it now this really is a, a decent mod um, the only problem I've got at the moment is to make full use of this I can't really stay at level one so I'll only be able to use a few of the uh, the spells properly but we'll see I'm gonna have to level it up at some stage anyway but uh, I'll try and set level one as long as I can. Okay, got a bit of a journey here. Oh, that's a player home uh, mod I wanted to review on. It's really good, actually, if, if you're playing a mage. Ooh. Oh, I'm horse and killed him. Oh, nom nom. That's not a bad little hole. Okay, let's see what this little chap's got. Ooh, my an arrow. If I remember rightly, this place is actually quite tricky to find. Ah, we'll get there eventually. Oh, bugger off. <laughs> As you can see, I haven't got rid of Genesee yet. I, oh, I, I really should. Because uh, I'm well OP at the moment. But I kind of really like her as a standalone stand vanilla kind of follower. I, I don't know, I just like her more than most of the others. Plus the fact she looks quite, kind of cute with the mods I've gone on. If you're into, you know, blue women with red eyes. I need help. Two-handed. Just what I never use.
I knew it was around here somewhere. It is quite tricky to find this place, though. Okay, now if I was going to play this how I wanted to, I'd, I'd want uh, the Frenzy spell. And it was a slightly higher level than the Yuzu's Conjuration as well, so get them to fight each other and just throw an Atronach in there. But I've got the muscle with me, so it's... Uh, we'll take the more direct route. And to be fair, at level 1, these are fairly easy, I guess. I missed twice. Oh, trying to nom nom. Go for disenchanting. My whiskers are freezing up. You little bastard. I'm not going to loot the whole place, I'm just going to loot what's around me. Um, there are a couple of little places you can go where you get quite a lot of decent loot. I'm not going to bother with those. But you might see that, I can't remember how much of the actual quests I did in the review video. Um, but yeah, it may be in that. Boy, here we go. Take that. Yeah, just down there, there's a cave with loads of loot. Uh, definitely, definitely worth going to. These guys are quite a handful, actually. Okay. 
Job done, if you will. Now, one of the spells in here, which I really love, it enables you to uh, lockpick or open any chest. I think it's up to expert. Uh, can't remember off the top of my head. Super handy. Especially if you're not particularly good at lockpicking a minigame. Um, and you get to conjure a bear. Okay, job done. Yeah, great thing about the Atrax, it takes her attention away from you. Um, yeah, awesome, half decent loot here. Enchanting. I didn't actually do a video on it, but I tried to rescue this woman because you can catch her alive at the beginning of, as you enter the uh, uh, the cave. But she just stays in the cell and dies. Uh, there's nothing you can do, which is really frustrating. But uh, hey. Okay, and like I said before, there's loads and loads of loot around. Um, in I think if you explore the whole place properly.
Oh, that's worth taking. Good for disenchanting. I think once I've done this, I might turn Leah into like a a mage assassin or rogue mage thief. I mean, do I go down here? Uh, I think I've got turned around. Yeah, I've come back in. These ice tunnels will get pretty confusing, is it down here? Ah, there you go. Okay. There we go. We've got all these spells and these can really make a difference. I mean, so, so this is a brilliant mod. Go and check out that video. It's a little bit long because I go into every spell in depth. Um, but you can really, really change your gameplay uh, with this uh, mod. It's really, really super. I mean, it's not just about the flashy spells, the destruction spells and stuff like that. It's, you've got Conjuration, Illusion, Alteration, uh, Water Breathing, Lock Picking. Uh, you've got a whole range of stuff and you can really, really change the way you play the game. Um, so I really, I, this, this is one of the few CC mods that I really recommend you get. It can be a bit OP, actually, so you've got to kind of play it right. Um, but yeah, I recommend this mod. Go and check out that video. I go through every single spell in a great amount of detail. Uh, so definitely worth checking it out. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the vid and uh, see you in the next one. And uh, don't forget, love you.